Hi, everyone. Um, obviously, we got a tall task ahead of us. Um, Kelly Jaycott suffered a, a season ending injury, um, not related to COVID this week. And uh, we got to hit the drawing board and figure out how to make up for her scoring, make up for her minutes um, and rebounding. I think our team was uh, definitely feeling that tonight. Um, I'm excited for three or four days of practice to be able to to fix that and to get in sync uh, without her on the court uh, and be ready to kind of just revamp uh, and get together and, and figure out how we're going to, um, by committee, uh, make up for, for that loss. All right, questions for coach. Go ahead, Alexis. Hi, Carolyn. You know, obviously Ke Kelly not playing tonight. You've said it countless times before. She's a leader on and off the floor and you know, not even with her production, but her leadership abilities. Um, what did the team lose or struggle in your eyes and your opinion without her on the floor tonight? Yeah, well, I mean, Kelly has such a high IQ uh, and she shares it very well. Um, and obviously we're the third youngest team in the country. So when you lose that experience and you lose that vet, it, it's going to hurt um, until we have time to kind of regroup and, and figure it out. But we just talked in the locker room. It's going to have to be by committee. It's not going to be one person doing it. Um, and it's an awesome opportunity for them to step up, for them to grow and uh, them to learn and, and have their sisters back. Go ahead, Alexis. And you, you just alluded to that, my next question at the end of your response, you know, what kind of positives can you take away from, you know, this first game without Kelly on the floor in terms of, you know, having other people step up, fill her minutes, obviously she led the team in minutes played and in points per game. So, you know, how does that positively affect your team? I think it's obviously going to create opportunities for others to have more experience. Um, we're going to have to get our guards to understand how to command and direct. Kelly did a lot for that on the court, um, you know, whether she was score, she was also our second leading rebounder. Um, so for that to start our break and to start our offense, she did a lot from that and commanding. Um, and I think our guards just need to get confident without her on the floor. Um, it was obviously an emotional week, uh, but we can't drop our heads and we can't use that as an excuse and we got to get better.